ever heard of paleontology, perhaps in Jurassic Park films? Simply put, it's the study of fossils. Most adults don't even think of it as a career, but we found a 15-year-old who is fascinated and has been obsessed with it since she was first introduced to this particular field through the picture of an ammonite fossil in the new children's encyclopedia, which was gifted to her by her father when she was five. Meet Aswatha Biju, a high school student who has earned the title India's Young Paleontologist. In a new the study of fossils is an intricate art and science. There are hardly any takers for it in the country. But for her, it might be a treasure trove of fossils. She spends long hours at fossil sites across India trying to unearth pieces of prehistory. Sometimes they could be fossilized conches, shells, dinosaur bones, leaf specimens, microfossil specimens and whatnot. She's even proficient in extracting, identifying and studying fossils all thanks to her mentors. When we go to the field, first one, first one we think of is where do one find the fossil? And if the fossil is found, whether it is fossil at all. The third one is how big is the fossil and am I collecting the entire organic remain or am I leaving out something? The next one will be the what is the association? of this fossil with other fossils. At home, the paleontologist has even curated a miniature fossil museum, a collection of over 130 fossils, all unearthed from various sites in the country. She doesn't stop with collecting and studying fossils. She even teaches her peer group about it, because fossils are key to understanding the world we live in. In India, we have more than 15 fossil sites, wherein I visited three fossil sites and collected 136 fossil specimens. My biggest desire is to visit all the fossil sites in India and get to know a lot more about the paleontological resources in our nation. My ambition is to pursue paleontology and become a renowned paleontologist and work under Molecular Paleontology Division. A recipient of numerous awards for her work with fossils, Aswatha was also bestowed with Pradhan Mantri Rashtriya Bal Puraskar. It is conferred to children for the extraordinary feats. It is the highest recognition yet for the young budding paleontologist. Rather than having paleontology as an allied course in Indian science institutes like IISC and IISCR, when we have it as a main course, it would be a big boon for young minds like us who are highly interested towards the field of paleontology. Thirdly, I would like to take over paleontology among many more people worldwide and make them conserve and preserve fossil resources. Besides her regular studies at school, she's focused on bigger goals. The teenager is working towards making it big in her field and specializing in molecular paleontology. This involves recovery of analysis of DNA from fossils to understand the evolution of different species.